guess what day it is? Guess. I don't know. <laughs> Just kidding. It is September 14th. Simple as a fish. I've been a fish in search of a bottom when I've surfaced, in search of surface when I've bottomed, and the ribbon of God's sea passing through my gills is what I've felt and thought and spoken. A simple fish nosing its way along the bottom is in itself a profound teacher, and like the deepest teachers, it doesn't even know it's teaching. Yet, in its tiny, efficient gill lives the mystery of how to live as a spirit on earth. As we all know, by swimming, the smallest fish takes in water, and its gill turns that water into the air by which it lives. Though there are biological details that explain the mechanics of this, it is, in essence, a mystery. The question is, what in us is our gill? Our heart, our mind, our spirit, a mix of all three? Whatever it is, like the smallest fish, we must turn water into air in order to live, which for us means turning our experience into something that can, that can sustain us. It means turning pain into wonder, heartache into joy. Nothing else matters. And just like fish, we must keep swimming to stay alive. We must keep swimming through the days. We cannot stop the flow of experience or the need to take it in. Rather, all our efforts must go into learning the secret of the gill, the secret of transforming what we go through into air. I just spit. So what is your gill? For me, it is my heart, and love becomes the unseeable trail I leave behind. But whatever it might be for you, it is more important to swim through the days and honor the gill inside you than to figure out how it all works. So what is your gill? I don't know what mine is. I guess that's why we're going to focus. Sit quietly and breathe slowly. As you breathe, notice how turning air into breath is what keeps you alive. Keep breathing slowly and as you breathe, open your heart to the mystery of turning experience into feeling and pain into wonder. I have a cat, oh, you can see her. Inhale deeply and let the gill inside of you work. So what is it? Did you think about it? Did you think about what your gill is? I'm going to have to think about mine. Right now, I have a kitty that needs love and she will not tolerate waiting. I love you. I love you. I love you. I hope that's enough for you today. I hope you have a kick-ass-tastic day and I hope that you have intended your way through this day. It definitely makes a change. And take your vitamins. That's a pretty big one too. I had not been taking my vitamins for quite some time. You know, your body needs those. I don't eat as well rounded as I should. I don't get all the nutrition I need and minerals from the food I consume. I'm pretty sure coffee is nutritional but it's not everything apparently. And then when you're feeling stressed or you're feeling depressed, your body goes into this thing where it depletes even more of those things. I had to dig out my vitamins and really, really start taking them again. And honestly, I found within about a week that that cloud was starting to lift. So do that, eat well, nurture yourself with good food, plenty of water and some vitamins and minerals. And then come back tomorrow and see me because I love this and I love hanging out with you. Have a great day.